Genesis has boldly entered the realm of fully electric vehicles with its latest offering. This new model, which transitions from hybrid technology, sits in line with the evolution taking place within the automotive industry. It has an electric makeover of the gasoline GV70, with a battery placed under the floor and control gear under the hood. This ensures additional storage space with a small cargo box. The vehicle doesn't deviate dramatically from its gasoline ancestor, but the front grille stands out with its intricate diamond pattern replacing the conventional air intake. The charging port finds a unique position within the grille, artistically integrated but raising questions about practicality due to its frontal location. At the rear, the absence of exhaust outlets is covered up by a sleek panel, giving it a clean look. The white brake calipers are notable, but the efficient regenerative braking system ensures they are hardly susceptible to gathering dust. The cabin is reminiscent of the gasoline model but with subtle differences. The driver's view is enriched by a boost button positioned in the center steering wheel spoke. The shifter paddles have been repurposed to control regenerative braking. The space beneath the cargo floor compensates for the slightly constrained rear seats. This new electric vehicle benefits from a simplified body structure. The rigidity provided by the battery box obviates the need for additional complexity. The suspension has been beefed up to withstand the additional weight of the electric components, ensuring driving dynamics comparable to the gasoline model. The dual-motor powertrain, featuring an all-wheel drive system, churns out a remarkable 429 horsepower. Sporting a 77.4 kilowatt-hour battery pack, it utilizes an 800-volt system enabling rapid charge rates. However, the estimated range falls slightly short of the GV60, presumably around 240 miles. The vehicle will be manufactured in the United States, specifically in Montgomery, Alabama. To be eligible for the revised federal EV tax credit, it must meet certain prerequisites including a price tag below $80,000 for SUVs. Pricing is estimated to be around $75,000. Owning an electric vehicle provides cost savings in terms of fuel and maintenance. The production of this vehicle is slated to commence imminently, and it shouldn't be long before they hit the dealerships. The gas-powered GV70 already enjoys a favorable reputation, and the anticipation surrounding this electric model is palpable. Examining the exterior design, it borrows heavily from the gasoline GV70, barring the closed-off grille and hidden charging ports. The design language is sharp and modern, embracing an effortlessly suave demeanor. Official performance specifications suggest a top speed of 116 miles per hour and an impressive 0 to 62 miles per hour in just 5.1 seconds. The expected range is about 310 miles, and the vehicle can be fully charged in less than two hours using a level 2 charger. The inside of the vehicle boasts a plethora of features such as a large infotainment screen, leather seating, and a panoramic sunroof. Safety hasn't been compromised, with features like forward collision avoidance and blind spot collision avoidance. Additionally, the convenience of wireless device charging is a welcome addition. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more car reviews and updates. See you in the next video.